municipal housing project east of downtown Houston is now in danger of being derailed. Greg Grugan broke the story in a series of reports. The complex at 800 Middle Street is literally surrounded by properties with some serious toxic contamination. Greg Grugan joining us live to tell us exactly why the state of Texas has launched an environmental intervention. Hey ladies, lead, arsenic, dioxin, just three of the toxins found on properties all around this new affordable housing complex. Now the state is concerned the scientific environmental information they received was greenwashed to get the go-ahead. Just six days after Fox 26 revealed shocking images of contaminated incinerator ash running 30 feet deep adjacent to the Houston Housing Authority's controversial 800 Middle Street project, the state of Texas felt compelled to step in. In a demand letter obtained by Fox 26, the Texas Department of Housing and Community Affairs has ordered a new environmental site assessment of the low-income project to be conducted by independent third-party experts. At City Hall, Councilmember Tiffany Thomas, chair of the Housing Committee, actually welcomed the intervention. I think it's the right thing to do. Um, my belief is truth minds no inquiry. So if the project is with integrity and the project is uh, clean, um, then a third party will either validate it. If the project is not clean, then that gives us more information to redirect, um, pause the development, and do what we need to do to cure the site. Emails obtained through open records requests indicate the controversial project on property adjacent to contaminated ash landfills and a former toxic lead state. Superfund site was set in motion by the city's chief development officer, Andy Icken. So, are you concerned about the viability of this project? If, if let, me, let me read the letter, let me understand the facts, and then I'll be able to get a good comment. Of all the beautiful places in Houston to build something, why would you build it around all these potential environmental risks? I don't, I don't get it. Well-known businessman, columnist, and Fox 26 contributor Bill King says the entire $100 million-plus project is now at serious risk because the tax-exempt status of the development hinged on a clean bill of environmental health. If the Texas, you know, department pulls the tax credits because they determined that they were misled, then this whole thing's going to blow up and be in bankruptcy. Fox 26 reached out to the Houston Housing Authority. We have yet to hear back. For now, I'm live on the east side. Greg Grugan, Fox 26 News. And we want to remind you that Greg broke this story a few months ago, and you can go back and check out all of his very interesting stories that he has done on fox26houston.com.